The very first thing is that the Atlanta Housing Authority, responsible for the public housing units in the city of Atlanta, is at present still segregated. I consider it totally impossible for the mayor to propose new programs when standing programs continue to be segregated. Number two, the first proposal for public housing was located totally in a Negro community. On yesterday, the Department of Housing and Urban Development indicated that from now on, no units will be built in a totally segregated area or in a ghetto. The mayor, through his representation, the Atlanta, Atlanta Housing Resources Committee and Atlanta Housing Authority, continue a segregated pattern. Well, all of our public housing units are integrated uh, at the present time, but to my knowledge, uh, there has been a heavy increase in the amount of integration in the units in the last year and a half, and there have been great strides made in this direction, and there's certainly no effort on the part of the city of Atlanta to in any way uh, create a racially segregated public housing program. We are requesting Mr. Weaver, Secretary of Housing and Urban Development, to withhold all funds to public housing and urban renewal programs until all discriminatory practices are eliminated and a balanced dispersion of public housing units is accomplished. Further, we are requesting the Secretary to withhold funds of the Model Cities Program until Atlanta officially adopts an open occupancy ordinance. I certainly hope they won't take any such precipitous action as that. After all, the city is involved in a program to try to develop adequate low-income rent units for all of the citizens of this city, and I would think that able organizations like the NAACP, which incidentally could be a sponsoring organization if they so chose, they could sponsor one of these projects in a site of their own location. We have invited our representatives from all agencies dealing in housing to a conference. No representative responded. The mayor has not responded to our request of 10 days ago. I promptly replied to Dr. Davis's letter on the 23rd of this month. I regret that he has not yet apparently received that reply. I'm glad to see any group of citizens at any time in regards to housing problems in the city of Atlanta.